Hello viewers and welcome to Kida Fan Salon Discoveries. Me na Asanato Labelsila. Well, today we then had a great prestigious city council all Osai Kida Fan films. They collaborate with Med M Production for premiere the movie title The Scuffle. This couple now one beautiful African story where they tell so much about Africa. Inside this movie also, you see Usai, a woman stand up for say me. I want for become a president of my nation. I want for all my country because we all believe say when women get the power and position, it will do the right thing for in family, in community and in country self at large. Entertainments will actually grow from one end to another end. I was an actor. I was part of this acting stuff. It's kind of expensive. It takes a lot. So I decided to go to the other side. And I decided to be a comedian. Say useless things for a living. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, for me, there is a man here. I've worked with him. He has produced a number of movies, mind games, and plenty of other movies. And he was an actor, decided to be a producer. 
is uh, currently a very new um, barrister and solicitor. He just passed the bar exams and he has been called to the bar. Please put your hands together for Mr. Sigismund as he will make a statement on behalf of producers. Please give it up. If you're not, if you're not ashamed of him, please put your hands together for him. Thank you. He was dictator at 40 at Fabi College. Did at 41 as well. I'm gonna entice with your plans in my hands. You always be prepared. Um, I was not prepared to make a statement, but you will forgive me, I will be co-switching. I'm here to talk on behalf of the producers. Um, the, uh, the, the, the movie production is a kind of profession in its own right, I must say. Just like when you say the legal profession, the medicine, engineering, uh, the problem we've been getting over years in Syria New is that we treat the movie for, for liberty. It's as if people are not treated. Uh, okay, it's back. Okay, sorry. Uh, people are not treating the movie industry with seriousness. We have people that are making money, they have money, but they see the movie. See? as something that will crash your investment. Except for those who have passion for it, like some of us. Like you were just saying, uh, there's a distinction, a thin line between an executive producer and that of a producer. That of a, an executive producer is somebody who is having the money and believe in the industry and say, okay, you guys, you have talent. I think I can invest in you. Unlike the user, is somebody probably that I've gone to the rank and file from, like an actor, um, a director, or like you say, the screenwriter, and so on and so forth, until to the stage of a producer. So if somebody is grounded in the field. So most times, that's why you do see a mixed blend of uh, financing and acting as well. I think somebody I will make mention of is like Jimmy B, there's Morfini, um, Papa Ray. These are people that have gone through the, going through the actual, like the grooming, and so this happening. If you think about the investment being cast, being production, trust me, the producer now will not continue. It will take him time to invest in another project. It happened for me when I produced Mind Game. I think what I get is the commission for Mind Game as producer and like the enemy and other international awards coming in. But when you talk about cash returns, when you invest, you need returns. It's not coming in. It's worth getting. That is why most of the people we see to produce the VAL, Jimmy B, and others, they do it for passion. They like it. If it's about profit, forget it. Scuffle, I would say roughly, I'm not too privy to it, but it's over $10,000 like I did for my oh, when I was in the state. It's over $10,000. I invested $10,000 or over in my game. Think about, the, think about the, the returns. It was premium all over the country. Not so far. But the 12 for motivate. If you get money, can't put time in the industry. Yeah, so yeah. Thank you very much. Please put your hands together for Adamantia Teshwa He's uh, Sigismond and I want to talk. <clears throat> so ladies and gentlemen, I would please like you to help me welcome. She is the producer and the executive producer of this great movie. Put your hands together for Dr. Aisatu. Kaki, the
Please, we are not clapping harder. We are not clapping harder. Don't show for the greatness and appreciation in life when you celebrate people, you will be celebrated. Please, come forward. Please, not give him a round of applause as he comes forward. Yeah, we are not clapping for that. We are not easy. To put this thing together, put that through. To be a producer and executive producer as well. And also for dress in this style, beautiful attire. I'm seeing white style. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for the producer. My next one is the producer. Madam Dr. Aisatu Kake Jalo. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Kiba Amani. And good evening, good evening. Salaamu Alaikum Rahmatullahi Wabarakatuh. I hope to see you. We all made it out so today. We make a safe for left now so we're gonna host them safely. Uh one for safe. Boku Boku thank you for now. All we come, we left what you wanna do out of this rain and for dinner. So for this movie, what we didn't ask for can witness. Not talk about me. Not talk about Dr. Isaac K. Jalo. No more about Sierra Leone. How we go move the industry forward. So as we don't make an ask, so we tell the Almighty. So I want to say, um, we want to say, Alhamdulillah. I say this for many different reasons. Um, today I get me family at this uh, hall. We travel with me from the state um, here, and uh, we come for a vacation. But we feel say we for still do something for we country Sierra Leone. We at this uh, premiering. I'm um, so passionate about salon, so then see who side take me. Now the film industry, now the entertainment sector. We make and we invest heavily into films them where we know say them film they are so not to salon no more for watch them. Then for watch them out of Sierra Leone. Then for watch them now other countries them where if we say we industry if we grow. So we we don't choose for say we want for invest in fame. Love we not discourage because I know we brought that really talk just now about uh, the frustration what we can go through as producers them as executive producers them. But it's not easy. It takes passion. It takes dedication. It takes determination. And I believe say we need all that plus the money for make sure say the film industry, the investment we they do, it becomes something. So I want to take this time, this opportunity before we begin, would it can't would it actually can start to play the score? Film? That we really can do as soon as I get off the stage. Please, the technical people there and that get ready for the amazing and most anticipated movie, blockbuster movie called the Scuffle. So we are already part of this project. Lord, be proud of yourself. But before going further, I want to say many, many thanks to all the producers them at the house. All the producers say, please raise your hand and say, you know, bravo to yourself because you've been doing so well. So well, producers. Thank you, thank you, thank you from uh, from myself, Dr. Istukake Jalo, from Darami A. Kaba, the president for Sierra Leone Film Guild. Afan John, another producer for The Scuffle, we want to say thank you. And also our director and cast, the entire cast and crew. We want to appreciate everybody within our soul. I was proud to see this film and I know you will be proud to trust me. In the first five to ten minutes of this film, you will see what we are talking about. And you can see throughout the entire film, and that's a promise. If you want to stay here and watch the entire film, it's going to be played throughout. Okay, so welcome, welcome to the premiering of the most anticipated movie premiere that is called The Scuffle. Breaking news. Dr. Diana Moegbe, Mr. Ibrahim Rashid Bayo, Madam Nyade Sharif and Benjamin Menelik George have all withdrawn from the presidential race. Fellow Sierra Leoneans, when I become your president, I promise... All what the PDA has ever done since inception is promise, promise, promise. I'll let my illustrious record speak for itself. As both parties gear on for the next election, the question still remains, who is fit 
to run the country. So I want to say thank you to my family, thank you to the Almighty Allah, to my parents, and also to my co-producers and um, the directors, and at the same time to all you amazing, wonderful guests here tonight. I want to say thank you. I appreciate you all for being here. Um, you are watching so many different things. I believe this is something you want to be part of. Uh, House of Stars coming to you. Next week, we are going to launch this at the Radisson Blue Hotel. So no miss a more, because this one is the win host. Yes. Uh -huh. It will be host. Yeah. We'll to uh, the CEO for King's Empire at some point. Let you can talk small about the anime. So thank you, thank you, you know, um, to the directors, the actors in the house, you know, to the producers as well, as well as the technical people, to our chairperson here, Kindo Amani, I want to say thank you. If I don't get to come back on stage, uh, I just want to thank my entire team. Uh, my family and friends that are here today, I want to say thank you. And this country, uh, this film, to tell you the truth, I don't want to talk anymore. I just want you to watch it and be the one to make the decision. The critical points that you think you might find. Because I mean, I'm going to be critical. I'll tell so you what I mean. Trust me. If you give me a film, I'll be critical. So that way, I want to make a film that would break boundaries. Not to the one I'm already watching us alone. I'm thinking, yes. when we go, we'll see what you're watching. Then watch Sam will be proud of the country, Sierra Leone. And in all this, I want to embrace each other. Lord, work together. Lord, be a collaboration to one another. I want to thank everybody who buy tickets with Kanazo. I want to thank everybody, all the media platforms, them, including me or when I a fan discoveries. And I want to tell AYB thank you. Yeah. I want to tell SLBC thank you. I want to say thank you to Sarah Network Radio. I want to say thank you to uh, the bloggers them. I want to connect blog. I want to say thank you to uh, Ibrahim Prosper. I want to say thank you to Sarah Kale and to now all the way blog for we. Um, also Afri Radio as well as AYB Radio and Culture Radio. I want to say thank you. I know I miss anybody, but if I forget, trust me, I come back up here and say thank you. But if I miss you, I'm so sorry. But to tell you the truth, Lord, watch this video, the scoffle I present to you. Thank you very much, Doctor. Um, you know, there are so many doctors here. Except Dr. Lai, can't be here. So I'm ex expecting informative education. I'm expecting entertainment. I'm also expecting the fact that we are in that atmosphere of accepting and believing in our own. That's what I'm expecting because this, it looks good. It looks really good. Oh, I feel excellent. I feel marvelous, you know, to see Sierra Leonean embracing Sierra Leone content. I think that's something we all will be happy and excited about. The Scuffle, as we all seen the trailer, it's a political movie. It talks about women's empowerment, women taking leadership. And um, this is a theme that we can relate to in our African nation, seeing that there's very little women you know, going into politics. So I believe this will inspire so many other women. Prophet General, now the last Mohican standing inside this industry will be right now. Now make the like the last and last energy of Kuputa for Wokoa. Ladies and gentlemen, before we watch the movie, I have uh, the honor to call the person that is going to officially launch the movie. She is so emotional and passionate, and she wants you all to watch the movie. He's a Come to my room, you know, that I can't allow that without uh, calling on the... I don't have English, man. It's not even good. I have trouble. Ladies and gentlemen, this lady happens to be, and uh, she is working currently as the 
Director of Strategic Coordination Management at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Dr. Kadiatu. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. You guys all seem excited. You're at a movie premiere. Come on. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening. Uh, and it looks like it's just this, this corner that's excited. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening. Good. I'm glad that we're at the premiere. My name is Kadijatu Grace. My singular job here tonight is to officially, officially launch um, this pride that we're about to see. Um, I am proud to be standing here. I'm also humbled. Um, in the U.S., I am one of the, the product of the U.S. Nollywood. I'm part of the U.S. Nollywood film. And I had been opportunity to be part of two big movies, um, Paparazzi with Van Vika. And there was uh, another movie with uh, Pichento Zoko um, Mamaji, as we know her. Uh, and I stopped and went back to school because I wanted more in life. Um, before we launch this, I want us to have the mindset of thinking. I cannot to eleven. Sierra Leone. Sierra Leone. Sierra Leone. How many times did I call us? Sierra Leone. It is time. We tell our stories beyond the borders through movies. And when you look at the history of film in the whole of West Africa, who is really the best? Sierra Leone owns it. But then now we're dragging. We're begging other actors to come into our country, act our films, tell our stories the way they choose to. And then we sit there and watch them. And we pay for these things. But then when it comes to us, we don't want to do it. I can relate to him. I can relate to so many of you that are sitting here. When we talk about human capital development, it starts with the movie industry, guys. When we tell our stories, we gotta start from home. If you don't support your own, who is going to? Let's say you come from a village when I had it called a local masama. And when I get one till and a local masama. And this one tiller now not only come to my local masama, but then when I, did, when I get the habit of degrading this one great tiller when I did only go. Do you know what you have done? You have messed everything up before you even got to it. So what do we do? How do we solve this problem that we're crying about? This one tiller when I get, when I did so all my punches, but still will not encourage and for make you go. Now, look at it in the movie light. If, excuse me, young lady, what's your name, please? Agnes, nine days so for we all. If Agnes so for me to assist, if I tell Agnes, say, I want to to assist, hold me tight, then Agnes, so I'm so big. Wow, Agnes, you do well, oh, this is fine, but I've been telling you, make and tight for me. You are next day, make and tight, yeah? What have you done? You have sown a seed of not only telling her, I believe in you, but you can do better because I see better. That is what we have done. And so let us look at it in a movie light. We don't want to hear our stories, we want to tell our stories, but then we don't know how. And then we sit there and complain, not on the government's irresponsibility, now me and you in our tongue, now your responsibility, to produce a good product. Give me a good story and see if it will not be the talk of the town. We have movie critics here, we have movie producers, we have investors that are interested in sponsoring the next project. But how can we tell our stories if we cannot produce good product? You don't just want to act film for acting sake. All man are an artist. Everybody now go act once upon a time. Now I? In our homes, in our schools, career marriages, everything, we all know act. But the truth of the matter is, when you are a gift, a talent, one of the things that you get to do is to actually practice that act. They have film academies. Yes, we know which they eat. But we know where the producer is. We know create one. Alona, coach, teach, and train these actors. 
how to present, how to talk, how to wait in, wait in on the storyline, let it give you exactly what the storyline is. And guess what? You don't have to go cry again, my brother said, they're not in help me. Now then they can't tell you. Say that female will do. I love it, I like it. How can we help? So as we are crying, say we know the help says, let me also look, because we'll point fingers. So this one they come back to me. Let me learn for take responsibilities and accountability of the work. Now this, I had the story, I mean, it is phenomenal. You have no idea. I see half. I was in tears. Just like um, doctor just said, sit tight, wait, and watch till you see an authentic, real movie where somebody actually took the time to not just put money into the movie, but they actually made sure that they are producing while you are sitting here. So ladies and gentlemen, as I said, my name is Kadija to Grace. I have overstayed my welcome. I just want all of us to stand up, please. Drum roll. For the first time in the history of Sierra Leone, the moment you've all been waiting for the Air Force One has landed, ladies and gentlemen, I present to you officially the movie 2023, The Scuffle. Good morning, Free Time. Good morning, Sierra Leone. Around this time tomorrow, Dr. Kader will be making her final stop on her campaign tour. Fellow Sierra Leoneans, when I become your president, I promise. All what the PDA has ever done since inception is promise, promise, promise. Breaking news, the presidential ask you. As both parties gear on for the next election, the question still remains, who is fit to run the country? With what has happened, do you think it's advisable for your clients to return to the election? I don't see why she can't. She's still innocent until proved otherwise. Politics in this part of the world is such a deadly game. We are going to fight until we get justice. justice no man is a problem. <laughs> is not fucking fit to rule this country. Do you understand? You are under arrest. Under arrest for what? For murder, man. Murder? Murder who? Arrested? For what? 80% of the masses want her to win, Your Excellency. A woman's place is in the kitchen. Wake up, Fatu! You can never, ever become the president of this country. Never! We want you to make him win the upcoming elections. Do your job and behave like a good boy. Do you understand? Yes, sir. What Sierra Leone needs right now is not another politician, but a true leader. There's no doubt in our minds that Dr. Keita might emerge the first female president of Sierra Leone. The president has assured us today that he would not use his power and influence to manipulate the election. The scuffle premiering at the Freetown City Council Auditorium. Hey, hey, Peter, Peter, Peter. Peter, actor, Peter, actor, Peter, actor. Oh, Junior Tumbu. Junior Tumbu. I must be back. Ah, uh -huh. uh -huh. wow, wow, so amazing, so amazing, so amazing. <laughs> Oi, 
yes are you excited are you happy are you inspired i want to say poku take it so we camera operators them daddy abu aska and sky we don't make you able for enjoy this particular episode here so me we bring the program come to you me na asana to la belsela so till we meet back for another edition tata Thank you.